Hi, this is Ryan from Monster Gardens. Today we're taking a look at a great cleaning product called Sun Gold. Sun Gold is a non-toxic, biodegradable, non-abrasive cleaning product that doesn't affect biological activity. And it's a great product to dissolve salts to get rid of that gunk that builds up on the outside of your reservoir and your trays. We're going to show you here a really funky reservoir that was dropped off to us to go ahead and try this product out. Um, Sun Gold actually comes in this, this container right here and it's uh, almost like a paste and what we went ahead and did is we put it in a spray bottle here that we've diluted and all we're going to do is spray the reservoir with the Sun Gold product. Now this this reservoir hasn't been wet in probably a year so this stuff uh, maybe even longer than a year so this stuff has actually been had a great amount of time to, to sit on here and cake just so it's working itself down into the into the grime. Now, I've cleaned quite a few trays in my grow history, and as I can see right now, this stuff is doing a good job of breaking up the, the film so that when I take the hose to it, it should come out pretty, pretty easily. You can see everything's dissolving in the tray. Now this isn't some crazy magic cleaner um, because truly if you did have one, it would be toxic to your garden. This is a biodegradable cleaner that's non-toxic, but it works excellent. So we've obviously, I only took about maybe a minute to rub that thing down with a minimal amount of the Sun Gold product. I mean, literally, I probably took less than a dime of the Sun Gold product and put it in that sprayer. So here we are ready. Let's go ahead and spray this guy down. All that kelp. Yeah. Can you reuse that kelp, Lion? Yeah, it's humic acid and kelp is probably most of what you're seeing here. Calcium buildup. A little calcium buildup. And what that's taking off right there is that the nutrient water actually dried in this reservoir outside. It got left outside. And it got dried in there. So that's my my first run, and of course, most people's reservoirs aren't going to be nearly that dirty. Right. I'm going to go ahead and uh, drain it. We're just going to scrub it down one last time, and you'll see it, how clean it will get. Most reservoirs would have uh, algae, right? Oh, yeah. Algae and calcium buildup. Two tablespoons per quart. It could be one, t it can go anywhere from one teaspoon per quart for light uses, light duty, to four tablespoons per quart. All I'm going to do is, because this reservoir was abnormally dirty, I'm just going to do two sprays to outswip it. Yeah. You can tell it dripped off of here. Oh, I see, yeah. Those are actually rust marks. And this must have been like coins or something that fell in or keys or something. I, I imagine it's probably a heat, uh, it's probably some sort of heating device. And this is like what, some in. graffiti or something? Some purple graffiti? Yeah, that's actually, that's actually if, you, if you've noticed that, you've obviously done your own plumbing. That's that's actually the primer that you use before you put <laughs> okay. PVC glue on pipe to make sure that it's got the waxy coat and taking off of it. This stuff will never come off of anything. It's literally, when this hits plastic, it actually melts the plastic just bond, slightly bonds and bonds it, huh? right to it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it was disinfected the first spray. I'm just being a little overkill here because I'm doing a video on cleaning a product. It smells like limonene or like citronella or something. Something about like... Yeah, you can tell it definitely has some sort of citrus. It's they effective. obviously don't tell you exactly what's in it. It's a proprietary formula. Before and after is a, it's a pretty big difference. Um, now, of course, I could have probably worked down in this area with the brush a little more. I was going really quickly because I got a video camera on me. I got to get back to the store. So uh, just wanted to show you guys real quick with just a couple minutes of your time, a couple spray outs, how simply and easily you can use a biodegradable, all natural or let's say non-toxic cleaner that would not only clean your trays, clean your reservoirs, but clean your pots and do so in a spray form, which is really nice. A lot of guys dunk their stuff in tanks and let it sit for days, which works excellent as well. And if you're that guy that uses the 55 gallon drum, fills them with water, lets your pot sit in there for a couple days and then just rinses them off, which is the easiest way to cl clean pots. Just throw a little bit of that sun gold in there with it. You know you're disinfecting it without having to use something like bleach. 
and you're doing so in a biodegradable way with a food safe product that's also plant safe and human safe. This is a product that goes extremely far for the price. Go ahead and try it in your garden. It's Sun Gold. This is available at monstergardens.com.